you see how I respond to her? Right? We can give either like a compliment or we can respond or if we're done, then we just wait. Okay? Now, today we're going to do the same thing. You'll use these, but you'll be using these with a partner at your desk. Everyone will have up there those circles. What are those called? We've used them before. Does anyone remember what those are called? So, uh, Cora. Oh, yeah. We talk about how they're different and the same, and it has a special name. It's called a Venn diagram. Venn diagram. Okay. So now we are going to model using the Venn diagram. Oh, but I need to wait because I have some friends in our boats too. Okay, so just turn your bodies here because we are going to use the front. Can you scoot back for me? Nina's Colonia, a little bit of space. Okay. I know it's a little bit different, but okay. show me you're ready. Sit crisscross that way, be fine, you can see. Okay, so everyone will have a bag. Do you see how I have the green circle? That means who's talking first? You are. Okay. I will reach into my bag. And I'm going to pick out a slip of paper. And I'll read it. And I'll show my partner too. True facts. Now I'm going to go look at my Venn diagram. There's Stella Luna, the book Stella Luna at the top. And there's facts. That's the article we read. Now I have to think true facts. Which one of these? You know, true facts. And then I'm going to do this. Oh, uh, true facts is. Bats, because when we read bats, it was teaching us a lot of real things about the story. And then to show me that she agrees with me, she's going to go like this, or nod. And then what I'll do is I will take my glue stick, I will glue this on, and it will go under bats, right? Okay, this is really important, are you ready? Okay. Do you see how I turned to my partner and I didn't just say, ooh, it goes here. I told her why I thought it went there. I want you to explain your thinking. If you pick one out of the bag, don't just say, here, explain to your partner, true facts. When we read about facts, I learned a lot of true facts in that story. That's how I know it goes under facts. So you'll practice explaining why, okay? If for some reason your partner makes a mistake, and maybe they thought true facts would go under Stella Luna. Ms. Colum could just go, oh. and she would take it, and then mm -hmm. she would share what she thinks. Okay. And she would say something like, oh, I actually think true facts goes under facts because, I know because, you can use these words, I know because, and then she would explain why. Does that make sense? When, if someone makes a mistake, we don't want to shout at them or say no, we want to explain our thinking. So today we're going to practice explaining our why. You can use these sentences. Okay, so repeat after me. I know because. I know because. In the book I saw. In the book I saw. Or the words said. Okay, so that's what we're going to do today. You will take turns going back and forth. The person, thank you, with the green circle, they talk. They reach in their bag, they pick one out, they turn to their partner and explain why or where it goes. Then they can glue it on, and then they switch. Thumbs up if you know what to do. Right. And you will go back and forth until they're done. If by chance you don't know what a word says, some of them have pictures to help you, but if you don't know, you can ask your partner to help you with a word. If you and your partner have both sounded out a word and you're still not sure, raise your hand. Okay? How do we feel about this activity?